<laughs> I think in the car we're still moving in that direction, so I think we have these glitches. So like I said, it's, it's really a pleasure for us to be here. Today we're here to talk about a brand. I've heard this from the media, I've heard this from the people in business. Is 2020 moving a little bit too slow? When we look at it, what's important for us is unless you know what you're selling, unless you know what you're aiming for, unless you have a goal to achieve that, it will just be an event. An event is not 2020. And therefore, the brand is extremely important for us because we think this is what Nepal represents and this is how we move together, all of us together, as a team. Like I said before, it's not the people in tourism only, it's the entire Nepalese community that will take this brand up together and move forward. We promised lifetime experiences and we intend to deliver that. Our logo says Visit Nepal 2020 Lifetime Experience. And that's exactly what we intend to do. Together with the policies, initiatives, and the brand that we create for ourselves. And if we go in the direction that we are all together, probably we'll get much more than what we expect. And therefore, it's all about lifetime experience. We have the deepest gorge and the highest mountains in Nepal. Nepal is ready to take place in the international stage and to this effort design a brand that represents Nepal truly. What, all, what we want to do really is to take this brand, not just to promote 2020. We say this often, it is 2020 and beyond. And therefore, we've spent a lot of time talking about it, discussing what we need to do to show Nepal as Nepal is. These are hand sketches that represent Nepal in many ways. We have the Lord, the birthplace of Lord Buddha, home to Shiva, and the frame that we have represents the inner soul of every Nepali in every way. So therefore, these are things that we have on a day to day. It's a way of our life. And we depict that in hand paintings that we think is most appropriate. We have adventure, a lot of adventure. We've got an amazing lifestyle from the highest mountains to the plains. We have the National Park with anything and everything that you want, actually, in a very, very small place. And this is the story I always share wherever I go. Because this is where true Nepal's commitment comes in. WWF recently said, Nepal announced that there are now an estimated 235 wild tigers in the country, nearly doubling the baseline of around 121 tigers in 2019. If these trends continue, Nepal could become the first country to double the national tiger population. It says a lot. And this is what Nepal is all about. Moving everything together. It's our culture. Over the centuries, Nepal has blended itself through culture, its environment, its design, its, 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 its the people that we have, the different religion, and the most beautiful thing of Nepal, and we eventually come in, in this unique blend of Nepali. And this is something very few people have, or few countries have, to offer to the rest of the world. With diverse people, and yet united in every way. And that makes us truly different. Therefore, the brand that we are unveiling today is not engineered. You know, we, we, we haven't had people sit and work on what needs to be. 
I think what we've done is the candid reflection of the way of our life, our daily life. What surrounds us on a day-to-day -day basis. Our values, our tradition, and the scenes that we have every morning we wake up. That's what the brand is all about. It's going back to the basic feeling what we are, and that's, that makes Nepal truly a unique destination in many ways. The local waves, the culture that we have. When I travel the world, and I'm very proud when I say I'm from Nepal, Nepal, five small words, but the love and affection that I get anywhere I go as a Nepali is amazing. The goodwill for Nepal exists already. And therefore, for us to work on this brand is not very difficult. We just need to go together. We need to believe in ourselves that there's so much more that people expect from us. Not in terms of the malls and what have you, but what we have as a natural entity in Nepal. A different lifestyle that we have in Nepal. So therefore, what we say, food, like everything else, brings us together. So gathering all the aspects of our culture under one brand can be extremely powerful. We need to bring all these different elements that we have and bring it to one place. And that was the biggest challenge that we had in 2020. It will influence the way people interact with us and how we perceive by different people from around the world. We need to bring all this together to one place. If you look at the streamline of Everest, it's amazingly beautiful. And we've taken that as a part of our design. Just a white dotted line that scribbles across, it has a very powerful meaning. It's a part of our brand. Yellow is a color of knowledge and learning. It symbolizes happiness, peace, and inner peace. We see yellow used in our daily life. In Dasai, you see these flowers all over the park. You see that on the foreheads of all the sadhus that we have. The golden statues that we have in every monastery. The flames that we have. The beautiful sunrise and the sunset that we have in this country. All represent yellow. The color of knowledge and learning, happiness and peace. It's a way of life that we take. We move forward just with the way of life of the people. The red of our flag symbolizes purity. That's what red has actually, is purity. Most frequently used in all different occasions, like when a child of a birth, a birth of a child, all the festive that we have, when our daughters get married, it's red sari, and our tikka, that symbolizes a lot. So red is an extremely important part of our culture. We use it almost daily. We have got colors. We have got different colors that we have in Nepal. The part that's used by the Sherpa community, which has an amazing colors that displays itself. Nepal's brand is us. It's our mountains, it's our plain, our temples, and our songs. That's what colors are. We're vibrant, we're great. Nepal's brand is a collective of all different hearts that we bring together. And therefore, color plays an extremely important role as we move forward. We call it Abib, used in many different functions, from holy to many different reasons that we have. It's something that we bless our kids with. We, we welcome people with this. We bid farewell with this. Tika has a lot of meaning to all of us. 
The, v the Vietnam Waste Secretary is very conscious of its responsibility in making the year 2020 a resounding success by implementing these brand strategies. And therefore, it's critically important that we have a brand that we all move forward with. If you look at the red circle up here, what you see is a lot of at least flagging it as you zoom into it. And therefore, what we have is Nepal, and we see it. Tourism TV. Please like, share and subscribe to stay updated on tourism news in Nepal.